Good morning. Welcome to the channel. This is Andrew with Running with Dr. Andrew. doing a really early morning run before we head home. Uh, we went to Columbia, Missouri just to do a little bit of a, they had a little comedian and uh, it was pretty fun. So we got to listen to her and uh, laugh a little bit and get to enjoy uh, this beautiful college town. Columbia, Missouri is where uh, University of Missouri is at, and that's where the MU Tigers play, so if you're a Missouri University Tigers fan, I guess this is, let's go Tigers. <laughs> uh, Written by that same sign, and it said it was 69 degrees, so it dropped just a little bit. Uh, feeling pretty good. Uh, the weather is great. You can tell it's just a little humid. It's going to definitely be pretty hot today. I think 91, 93 degree, degrees today for the high, and uh, I think it's supposed to dip back down into the 60s again, and then have a couple days, two or three days of 90 degree weather. Welcome back to the channel. This is Andrew with Running with Dr. Andrew. And today we're doing a six mile run. Kind of a little bit of a walk as well. And uh, it is a little dark, so I've got my light on my uh, camera here. So hopefully everyone can see me. I can't see, I'm gonna get kind of blinded by the, <laughs> by the light. But did a, had a two mile walk with my wife and then did a four mile run all together six miles just a kind of recovery uh, from the 60 miles that we did last week and whew, tell you what that is tough doing 60 miles this is the more most 60 mile runs i've done in one training block and this week we'll have time to do a little bit more running and so hopefully maybe i'll get at least um, 70 miles in and then build back up from there. Uh, definitely a beautiful night. You can definitely see the moon out pretty good and just an enjoyable night to run. Just a little dark, it's getting darker earlier as what everyone knows. And so how's everyone's week starting out? It's definitely been a good week for me. All right, we'll talk to you when I get back. All right, welcome back, everyone. I did get done with my six-mile uh, run. Uh, definitely took a little bit of time just because of the two first two miles I did uh, walk and then ran the other four four miles uh, within 10 minutes to 9, 30-minute pace. Just taking my time with the, the race, and or I'm sorry, taking time with the run so that way I can recover because tomorrow... I'm going to do, attempt to do the 18.7 mile long run and so that way I get my long run done early and I can concentrate more on speed and tempo work the rest of the week and I'm attempting to try to do 70 miles. I did do 60 miles last week and I'm going to bump it up to 70 miles. I have a lot of time this week to kind of get that mileage done and then we'll see what we can do the following week um, to continue on to, to progress to the marathon goal. To, and so today is the start of uh, week number seven. And this is what the 
this is what the graph looks like so far. So we have first week 50 weeks, 55, 60 and a half, 62 miles, and we dip down to 36, went up to 60, and now we're going up to 70, hopefully. Um, so this is kind of what this looks like here. Good training training block that we have going on here. And so then that means we've got 10 weeks left of marathon training before uh, the Little Rock Marathon. So I'm pretty excited. Starting to, like I said, this week, I'm gonna get some, uh, hopefully some track work in. I uh, haven't been doing any track work, but it's just been doing the uh, mile repeats around my um, neighborhood, which is pretty challenging just because it's pretty hilly. So I'm getting some hill work in as well. And uh, that will uh, help out. <clears throat> maybe doing some stair work, maybe doing some sprints on the track work as well. And hopefully that gets everything, gets my legs moving. I think definitely the, the heel work <laughs> seems to help out because I know whenever I get back to, you know, on racing, uh, that uh, my legs will definitely turn over a little quicker just because of all the heel work I'm having to do. My legs are stronger. I'm still doing a lot of weightlifting. I uh, weightlifted today, and then uh, we're resting on weightlifting tomorrow. Then Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, I do more uh, weightlifting. And uh, I feel like I'm getting a little stronger, too. So a lot of the weights I was doing, I'm increasing my weights. Uh, doing a lot of single leg squat type exercises, sit to stand. Single leg sit to stand exercises that's weighted. Lunging. Uh, doing a lot of core work, uh, upper body work, some pull-ups. Uh, dips just to kind of get the arms improved with strength as well. I think definitely that's important to help out with the, the overall training of this marathon. So this ends this video. So I hope everyone keeps safe out there, keep running, and we'll see you next time.